My name is Quentin the Quantum Slime, and I'm here to teach you everything you need to know about ranching slimes. Follow my easy steps, and you'll be raking in the new bucks in no time. The key to making new bucks are plorts, and to get plorts, you'll need slimes. Slimes can be found all over the far, far range, and there are a huge variety of different types of slimes for you to ranch. How do you get plorts from slimes, you ask? Simple. Food goes in. Plorts come out. Different slimes produce different plorts, so be sure to take care of a variety of slimes in order to diversify your plort folio. Many slimes also have favorite foods and will produce double plorts when they eat it, so be sure to take the time to get to know your slimes and you'll be raking in the new bucks in no time. Finally, slimes can be combined together into largos by being fed the plorts of a different type of slime, making a super big, super happy hybrid slime that produces both types of plorts. That means four plorts when fed a favorite food. Cha-ching! But you'll need to be careful. If a slime eats a third type of plort, they'll transform into a tar, a dangerous slime that floats around the far, far range eating all other slimes in its path. In that case, you'll have to call in the Tarminator to take those tars down. Once you've got all of your plorts, you'll want to sell them on the plort market, but be sure to study the market. The more of one type of plort you sell, the lower its value will be. So give the market some time to readjust and you can really maximize your profit. And that concludes my first lesson on plortonomics. Do we have any questions? Uh, Th Thomas? Nancy? Ah... <sighs>